Hi everyone, and welcome to another episode of Casual Game Gab, brought to you by CasualGameGuides.com. I'm your host, Tracy Jerry, and today I was really excited to discover that the latest Agency of Anomalies game has just been released. This installment is called The Last Performance, and it has us venturing out to an old theater where we must save a bunch of performers from a dark and mysterious brotherhood. Anyhow, it sounds great, so what I thought I would do for you today is take you through a bit of the first chapter of the game so we can see just how awesome, or not, this new game is together. Ready to venture into paranormal investigation? Here we go! Ugh, how many times have I told you to shut the door? Another ghost got in. Uh-oh. And the walls are talking again. Hate it when that happens. So I have to get in my lovely car and almost hit a dark angel. Oh, I'm a poor driver. Who gets out that side of the car? Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, her lips I'm aren't so moving. She's talking to me with her mind. All of us theater oh. Honey, what did you do to your eyebrows? Along with our human forms. Please help, help us. Okay, let's help. help. Oh, we don't need a tutorial. We know how to play these games. Alright, I have a confession to make. I might have played this game a little bit before I started recording. Just so I didn't look like a spaz. So, this way it can kind of show you more of the gameplay and you don't get to see my awesome skills. Okay, let's destroy that fuse. Why is there always some sort of electrical phenomenon in these games? Okay, here's our first hidden object scene. Let's put the nose on that little man. Pop the cork on the champagne. Caterpillar. Scary doll, wig, coral, handkerchief, tiles, monocle. I just read somewhere that Mr. Peanut wears his monocle just for show. There's no prescription in it. Oh no, let's talk to this guy. I saw Eve Are you okay? Oh, Do you need to like sit down? Hello, my name is Gerard. I'm the assistant oh, the look at that. Founder, Patrice, you just kind of you have her picture Edelstein. on you. I was, That's normal. But right it's okay. You just carry it around just for safekeeping in case someone asks. Freaks. I don't know what will become of us now. I, I, I guess so. Will you Maybe. Leaves. <laughs> Let's jump in them. Or let's take this cord. Awesome. First mini game. Let's put these tiles here. And this is going to kind of act as a walkthrough too because I already know how to do this puzzle. So watch me work my magic. If you are looking for a complete walkthrough written um, we are going to have one up at casualgameguides.com. By the time you see this video, it should be almost done. So come and join us there. Ooh. You know it's going to be a scary game when they start putting those masquerade masks in it. Someone gave me one of those once and I just didn't know what to do with it. I said thank you and quietly put it in a drawer and every now and then I forget it's in there and I open it and it's staring at me and I scream. Oh see we could skip right now but I'm telling you this is how you do it.
Almost done. One more. See, the key is to wait to do those last four corners till the end. Because they only move by themselves. Oh, look, it's got screws. Okay. Alright, well, let's go forward. Oh, creepy birdman statues. Awesome. Suitcase. Money. This might be useful. What's over here? Les Somme Hubert. Hubert. Oh, scissors. Was looking for those. Alrighty. Let's go back here. And <clears throat> is anybody looking? Excuse me. I just need to take this. this. No problem, right? You don't you don't mind. It looks better that way. Okay, let's try and get in this theater. Well, you know, while we're just sitting here, let's clean up a little bit. Clean that with Oh! Well, that was... Oh, she's back. She's back. She's using her powers. Oh, thanks. Use them. We now have powers. That was pretty quick. Normally it takes a little bit to get powers in these games. We have the power of astral projection. I don't know what that means. Ooh, this is a fun little mini game. So you have to move these vortexes around. Aren't they pretty? And you have to get that white stuff into the black hole. Just like that. Alright, now we're using our power. And we created an astral projection where we can pick things up. So we just got a lantern. And if you come back here, you'll notice this guy is missing a lantern. And apparently was keeping the handle of the door in his hat. It's a very, very handy place to carry door handles. Alright, let's go here and let's open this door. Oh, I guess I have to actually, yeah, hit the handle. Okay, let's go inside this theater. Awesome. Everything is glinting because, yes, I am playing on casual mode. Don't judge me. Let's get this key and more money. I'll take it. Sweet. Alright, so we've got that key. Uh, let's go back to the suitcase. That's right. We need to use the key on the suitcase. Open it up. Rifle through someone else's belongings. Oh, experiments. Gotta love those experiments. Screwdriver. Always need one of those. Alright, let's go back inside. One more. And over here. Okay, here is a hidden object scene. Except these are one of those scenes where you have to kind of put the objects back in the scene. I like these. These are fun. Put the sun over here. We just need to... Glue up this calendar. Put the tulip there. Hangers. Clothes pins. Beads. Makeup. Russian doll. I don't know what that was. Pencil. Color in the rainbow. Awesome. All that for a battery. We'll need that later. We're going to pick up some glue over here, and then next to this plant is a bell. This is mine now. <laughs> okay, that's great. That's called stealing, but... Just picking things up. So you have to do all of that just to get a feather duster. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's come back over here. And... Let's see, yes. I see those things glinting at me. Alright, let's use the screwdriver on this little panel to take it off. And you'll see behind here is another mini game. Oh, this one's kind of hard. I don't remember how to do it. 
Um, okay, so the point of this game is you have to get all these pretty colors to match up so that the energy runs from one side from the battery over to the other side. And every single one of these colors need to be lit up. Shoot, that's not it. Um, hang on, hang on. I'm gonna get there. There we go. All right. Try, we'll try move this along. And we put that there. So I guess the key to this is just trying to find out, like, pick one color and keep on fitting the pieces in. You gotta just keep looking for like the pieces that have whatever colors you're looking for. See that one? We needed pink and green. If you hear me drinking over here, it's because it's after five and I decided to treat myself to a game and a beer. I'm currently drinking a Longboard Island Lager this reminds me of my vacation because this is all I drank. It's quite tasty. All right. Just a little bit more, just about halfway there. Shoot. I'm going as fast as I can. I forget how to do this one. I know you're probably screaming at me now going Tracy. It's there. It's obvious. It's right there. I'll get there. I'm not super great at the mini games. There. Yellow. One more yellow. Yellow and pink. Oh, we're so close. There we go. Easy as pie. 25 cent piece. Ooh, wonder what will happen if I press the red button. Let's press it. Oh, the chandelier came crashing to the ground. Who knew that would happen? Alright, well we made a mess. Broom handle. Note. Started the experiments. There's always experiments in this game. Putting the broom together with the cord and the broom handle. Now we can go clean up all the glass so we can get in that door. What we really need to do is get over to that fish tank because there's a key there. Tiny key. It's just the thing. All right, now we got to head back and there's this donation box. We got to wait. I got to. Click the key. Okay, and there's more money. We just stole from the poor box. How do you feel? Okay, well now we're going to put money in this cash register. Sweet. We just bought a ticket. Ticket to the show. And we're going to put the ticket in here and it's going to open the gate. And apparently let anybody else in as well. Hidden object scene. Okay, this is like the... You have to find the objects. Uh, you can see the silhouettes. Some of them are pretty easy, but... Like that one was kind of hard. That one took me forever to find. Um, wheel, and there's a moth. Tea kettle. Some sort of gear. The number nine. I don't know what that thing's called. Spool of thread. All that for a power cord. Alright, so this little statue is missing a bell. So that kind of turns him around. Now we have to dust. Dust. And here's another mini game. Okay. This one I think I remember. The point of this game is to get these little rays of light um, to light all the light bulbs all around. So you have to get each one of these little pipes to point in the right direction. Mm. Oh, 
almost there. Three. Got that one. Wait a minute. There we go. Okay. Just a couple more. What am I missing? One more. Oh, the one at the bottom. There we go. Alrighty then. I think that's where I'm going to stop it. I don't want to show you too much of the game. Like what that fancy man is going to say. Um, yeah, overall, I mean, I think it's a great game. The graphics are stunning. The gameplay is fun and interesting. I love that they mix up the hidden object scenes with the silhouettes, the traditional hidden object scenes, and, you know, put the objects back into the scene. Um, just a really great game and a great addition to the Agency of Anomalies um, franchise. Alrighty, that's enough of me talking. I hope you try the game out. Let me know what you think. Uh, leave a comment below. The game is available for free download at casualgameguides.com. We're also going to have a full walkthrough up there for you guys. So if you get stuck, don't forget, you can always come visit us. And we're there to help you out. Uh, this has been another episode of Casual Game Gab. I'm Tracy, and my beer's empty, so I'm out of here. See you next time.